Hey, Trevor Matthews from Refrigeration Mentor again at the 2022 Chilventa Expo. I'm here at the Emerson Brew talking with Olivier Louis Yeah. Um, what's your role at uh, Copeland and Emerson? So I'm director of marketing for refrigeration, so taking care of the retail application, mainly with natural refrigerants. Yeah. So we've been hearing about this transcritical scroll for many years, and we know here in Europe that uh, Emerson has been uh, producing CO2 condensing units for many, many years now. But now they have this new unit with the new transcritical scroll. Do you want to just go through it a little bit with us? Yeah, sure. So what do you have here? You have two compressors, which delivers about 30 kilowatts of medium term cooling capacity. So the big new thing here, it's crawl inside with CO2 transcritical, and we are using the vapor injection at each compressor inlet to basically boost the efficiency, have like a parallel compression built in the compressor. Wow. So that makes it very efficient. And as you can see also, it's very compact. For a 30 kilowatt machine, this is really, really compact, which is good for the city center yeah. application. Yeah, exactly. So the other good thing about the unit is it can be modular. So you can split the, comp the compression module and the gas cooler. Oh, wow. You can put one on the roof, the other one in the building or vice versa. Okay. So you can really combine the way you want to be as efficient, as quiet that you want to be. Yeah, that is, that is really cool because I've seen this for many, many years, even when I used to be at Emerson, when they talked about it, now it's here. So sure. this is what's great. So I no. hear there are some installations globally with the transcritical scroll, and we're going to continue to see this grow more and more. And what I really like about it is compact, and it's a technology that is, it's a very simple technology. Indeed, eh? that, that's the beauty of the technology, that you don't need multiple systems depending where you operate in the climate and so on. With one design, basically, you can cover all. Okay, so I got to do have a couple of questions. So when that temperature gets really high and we're in the middle of the summertime, we're above that transcritical point and we got a lot of flash gas. What is actually happening here? Because we got from the gas cooler condenser there, we got a lot of flash gas coming. What is actually happening in the compressor? So we have indeed a lot of flash gas which are generated with the high ambient. So the good thing is that they directly inject it inside the scroll. Okay. So we don't get, we don't put them back in the suction or we don't need an additional compressor. So they are really, basically it's the most efficient way you can do because they are just recompress what, what is needed. Okay. So that's really, and then we have, of course, in the electrical cabinet, we have the controller, which is really managing in an efficient and reliable okay. way, yeah. this, uh, this vapor injection. Okay, another good question then. So as the pressure starts to rise in the flash tank receiver, the controller would say, okay, the pressure's getting really high, open this solenoid here to start yeah. injecting. Is that how yeah. it goes? Yeah, yeah, and yeah. Based yeah. off pressure? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. indeed. Eh? So it's, it's also managing, uh, making sure that the compressor stay within the safe limits, let's say. Awesome, I, I love this, I love this. So if you want to learn more about uh, Copeland's CO2 transcritical scroll technology, head out to their website. They got a lot of great information there. I want to thank you, Olivier, for your time. Thank you, Trevor. Thanks. Hey, I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I hope you got something out of it, something that you can use in your daily life. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, and click the bell button because when you do click the bell button, it will notify you anytime new videos are released. Also, check out the Refrigeration Mentor webpage at refrigerationmentor.com where I'll have all the different trainings, upcoming events, the different podcasts I've been on, as well as the Refrigeration Mentor podcast. If you want to check that out on Apple, Spotify, Google, any service provider of your choice. Super excited to see you at the next video. Now let's get a conversation going.